emotional reunion today. A South County man recovering from COVID-19 got to see his family for the first time in five weeks. He's the first person in St. Louis to receive a plasma treatment. That's why he thought our camera crew was invited to this. He had no idea. I'm getting goosebumps right now. His wife and three kids were there as well. News 4 Kim St. Ange has the story. Tim Hoffman has spent the last five weeks fighting COVID-19 here at Mercy South. Doctors say he had an 80% chance of dying. Today, his wife brought to tears getting to see her husband after his brush with death. It's a very emotional day for us. It's been um, five weeks since we've seen him. Still very weak, Jim Hoffman was wheeled out of Mercy South expecting to see us, not his wife and three kids. Oh, we love you, Dad. We are so proud of you. With his team of doctors' approval, they were allowed to hug. The big story really here is, you know, a random act of kindness of some God it came in, donated some plasma, and saved my life. Jim received the plasma on April 9th, 13 days after he was admitted to the hospital with a fever, cough, and body aches. He was in shock, multi-organ failure, what we call, and his kidneys also started to shut down. As a last ditch effort, doctors wanted to try a plasma treatment, knowing there could be side effects. It's still considered an experimental therapy. It takes the good antibodies from someone who has recovered from COVID-19 and transfers them to someone who is struggling to fight off the virus. The next day he had a remarkable recovery after that. And he was off the ventilator in like two or three days. His blood pressure stabilized. 14 COVID-19 patients have received plasma at Mercy South alone. Only three of them didn't seem to respond to the treatment. I want to get out of here and I want to get home. You know, I just want to be with my family and, and enjoy life again. Doctors think Jim should be able to go home next week. Until then, and even when he goes home, he'll have to continue doing physical therapy. Jim tells me one day he hopes to meet the man who kindly donated plasma and saved his life. At Mercy South, Kim St. Ange, News 4.